horses are on the track for DuCoin's fifth race. The Hayes Memorial for two-year-old trotting fillies. The Grand Circuit, $44,000 purse, twenty-two grand to win. Number one, Habits Lady, owned by Status Tables Incorporated of Chestnut Hill, Massachusetts, trained by Buzzy Schulte. John Campbell is in the bike. Number two, Blackberry Hanover, owned by David McDuffie of Nashua, New Hampshire, and Irving Liverman of Quebec, trained by Brett Pelling, the driver, Dave McGee. Number three, Warcat Hall, was owned by Samson Street Stables of Old Forge, Pennsylvania, and Jerry Silva of Belmore, New York, trained by Ron Gerfine of Delray Beach, Florida. The driver is Eric Ledford. Number four is Rare Elegance, owned by Brittany Farms of George Siegel of Versailles, Kentucky, trained by Ron Gerfine. The driver is Mike Lachance. Number five, Muscle Toy is owned by Sean O'Mara of Fort Wayne, Indiana, trained and driven by Mark O'Mara. On the monitors, here's the six, Mystical Sunshine, owned by Peggy and Jack Hood of Valparaiso, Indiana, and Dennis Lacomi of Sherrillville, Indiana, trained by Irvin Miller, the driver, Andy Miller. Number seven, actually on the monitors first, folks, there was the, six, or the five, Muscle Toy. Now here's the seven, Apple Martini owned by Royal Wire Products Incorporated of North Royalton, Ohio. Don Swick is the trainer, and Jimmy Tactor is the driver. The Hayes Memorial kicks off the Grand Circuit races for the week here at DuCoin. Grand Circuit's been coming here since the 1940s. They'll be at the post in only two minutes, two minutes on this Hayes Memorial. They are at the post for this Grand Circuit two-year-old Philly trot, and here they come, race five. They are off and trotting, and there goes Warcat Hall for the early lead and quickly latches onto the rail, followed by Rare Elegance as they move into the first turn. Apple Martini moves up wide along with Muscle Toy as they race toward the quarter, and trotters are still four across the racetrack, and there goes Muscle Toy out of that crowd to get the lead and now angles over toward the rail. Muscle Toy leading Apple Martini, who is still parked, and now Apple Martini backs up to find a spot against the rail in second. Rare Elegance is racing in the third position, followed by Warcat Hall, and then Habits Lady, Blackberry Hanover next to last, and Mystical Sunshine Trails, but is right there. 29 and 4 was the time for the opening quarter. Muscle Toy leads it by two lengths up the back stretch. Apple Martini second by three. Rare Elegance racing in third. Warcat Hall is fourth. Habits Lady is fifth. Mystical Sunshine on the outside is sixth. And now there goes Habits Lady to the outside, moving from the back of the pack as well. Blackberry Hanover now the trailer, seven lengths off the lead. At the half, it is Muscle Toy on top, the half in 59 and 2. Muscle Toy leads it by two lengths, and now Habits Lady has moved up into second around the outside of Apple Martini, followed by Mystical Sunshine in fourth, who's three lengths off the lead. Midway on the far turn, Muscle Toy leading it a length and a half. Habits Lady dives over toward the rail to catch a breather in second. Mystical Sunshine moves up and now takes second by a neck on her outside, followed by Apple Martini against the rail, flanked by Blackberry Hanover, who's still five lengths away. Three quarters and 127 and four. Muscle Toy leads it by two lengths off the far turn. Mystical Sunshine goes second. Habits Lady is racing in the third position. Then Apple Martini and Blackberry Hanover up on the outside. Into the final eighth mile. Two-year-old trotting fillies led by Muscle Toy by two lengths. Mystical Sunshine second. Then Blackberry Hanover, Apple Martini, and Habits Lady toward the rail. It is Muscle Toy hanging tough, and Muscle Toy wins it by two and a half lengths. Mystical Sunshine was home second. Blackberry Hanover on the grandstand side was third in 156 and 3. Folks, a man who's been in the winter circle here before he won the Philly World Trotting Derby a few years ago as the trainer driver of Lassie's Goal. How about a hand for Mr. Mark O'Mara with number five, Muscle Toy. Muscle Toy, a two-year-old filly by Muscles Yankee, owned by Mark's brother, Sean O'Mara of Fort Wayne, Indiana, bred by Peretti Farms of New Jersey. And this New Jersey bred filly scores in 156-3, and three, just misses the national season's record. Jane Hayes Raider, 
making the presentation of the trophy, her father, the late Gene Hayes.